matter how much solar you've had during the day, you're gonna have to draw it from the batteries and this is like a bottleneck. So when it comes to being a standalone battery system, this is the five kilowatt My Energy system. What this means is when you've got your kettle running at two kilowatts, and you've got maybe a one kilowatt base load in the rest of the house, that's three kilowatts already. If you've put an EV car on, on a normal plug in the wall and you run at maybe 10 amps, you, you're running out of headroom to be able to provide power to the house all at the same time. In the day, it's all right, because you've got solar at the same time, but at, at night, once the sun goes down, all you've got is this inverter. No matter how much solar you've had during the day, you're gonna have to draw it from the batteries and this is like a bottleneck. Now, Moving up to the five kilowatts just allows a bit more power to come through. So the My Energy one is a fantastic sized battery to go with the, the loads that you're gonna get in the typical home, um, a five kilowatt inverter. Now, when you move down to battery storage, this can come with just a single unit like this, five kilowatt hours. The difference between kilowatts and kilowatt hours is five kilowatts is power at once and Kilowatt hours is like energy over time or stored energy. What it means is you, you're gonna be getting the most of all that solar that comes in and you've got the flexibility then to decide what you do with that power. So later in the evening, you've got enough stored energy to see you through the night, ready for the solar again the next day to charge it up. This battery's also got the capability of charging from the grid. With time of use tariffs, such as Octopus Go or Octopus Intelligent or any of the other um, providers that provide similar tariffs, you're gonna be able to charge at a cheaper energy rate and then use the energy later when the rates would be higher. Now, in an ideal world, your solar and the battery between them are just gonna power a massive amount of the home without needing to support it from the grid. But in the winter, when there's hardly any sun, you're gonna to want to be adding extra power in from the grid and the battery system's gonna manage all of that.